Good morning. Today we are making donuts. I have donut pans coming and I am super pumped. This kid has had me up most of the night again. I'm getting a pimple on my neck. You know, it's just fun quarantine times. Look at this crazy hair. <sighs> my friend pointed out she liked my bread video, but I wasn't being the real me. And the real me is crazy. It's loud. It's messy. <laughs> um, somewhat organized, but mostly chaos. So this video will probably be a lot different. You're going to see the real May. So I've gotten nowhere with my donut recipe yet because my donut pans have not arrived. Um, however, I did get what I thought was Honey Nut Cheerios, Cheerios yesterday in the mail. And Jackson just said, Mommy, I want more cereal. So I said, Okay, honey. And I opened the box and it's a Glade Press and Seal. That's not going to work. So since the boys are on like their 10th serving of breakfast, like cereal or whatever, um, and it doesn't look like my donut pans are gonna be here for breakfast or brunch. Probably not even lunch. So, I am making myself some breakfast. Austin's helping me. Not really. Um, and I make this a lot. Oh, shells. That sounds like a swear word. Oh, shells. Um, anyway, I make this a lot for breakfast, and it's funny because it's gross. Like, I make scrambled eggs with cottage cheese in them. Ew, I know, right? Um, but it's delicious. It's so stinking good. Um, it just adds, like, the perfect amount of creaminess to your eggs. Now, if you like cottage cheese, go you. But, like, this is disgusting. Uh, but it melts in with the eggs, and then it ends up tasting really good. And I also like to throw in some roasted bell pepper strips because it tastes so good. Um, spinach is good too, but I don't always have fresh spinach. Um, however, I'm growing some in my potted garden this year. I decided potted garden, not pot garden, potted. Yeah, bud. You want your bicycle? Well, we can play with it later. Um, yeah, it's in the garage. Oh, crap, that's a massive pepper. Yeah, okay. Anyway, so I have my bell peppers, my cottage cheese, and some salt and pepper. Salt? <laughs> okay, there's no pepper in there. So we have salt, no pepper. I'm just going to mix this together. Um, I have butter in the pan just so things don't stick, even though it's non-stick. Is anything really non-stick? Maybe silicone, which my donut pans, um, my donut pans have, uh, they're going to be silicone. So hopefully those will be non-stick. We'll find out. I've never actually made donuts before. So this is going to be a venture for everybody. All right, anyway, I scrambled these, and I'm going to have a piece of my crusty bread that I made yesterday, but I thought I'd share a little tidbit about the cottage cheese. This has been a very long tidbit, but it's really good, and you should try it. 